To my channel so for today's video I am gonna be driving home to surprise my family it is the first drive with me in the new car and I'm so excited first of all though I'm slightly traumatized I'm not even gonna lie about it by this wind I feel like when it was really bad down south we didn't actually have it that bad up here and now honest to god i actually didn't think i was going to make it to my car then it was that bad i've got my suitcase already packed to go to dubai and it is a heavy heavy suitcase like it's huge and the wind fully blew it into the road and i was like walking against the wind and i couldn't move but the wind was that strong i could not walk i've never experienced wind like this or weather like this in my life last night i barely slept because i live in an apartment building and the wind was like i can't it was like whistling but also like singing i can't explain it, it was the weirdest thing and uh yeah i've just never really experienced weather like this so i'm a little bit traumatized like i said i'm driving home to surprise my family today so my mum actually knows that i'm coming because obviously i kind of needed to let someone know that i'm coming just to make sure that they're in and pam also knows and i texted pam and i was like okay i want to pick nan up can you make sure she's in so i'm gonna go pick my nan up later and i'm gonna also pick atticus up from school he is honestly gonna freak he has wanted to see my car so bad and mum tells me every day how much he misses me i'm literally just gonna park up outside the school and go and wait in the school playground and yeah i'm just so excited so i'm gonna do that basically i am actually off to dubai I like in the early hours of this evening we're leaving at like half past two in the morning for the airport and we're driving to Heathrow I'm going with Tanisha and I didn't want to drive like from Manchester to Heathrow so I thought okay I'm gonna make a day of it I'm gonna drive down I'm gonna see my family before I go and yeah I'm just really excited so this is the longest journey the, well, the longest drive to minutes I've actually ever done it is two hours 40 minutes on the sat nav and it's currently quarter past 11 so I'm gonna go and drop my house key off at Freya's and then I am gonna set off I'm definitely gonna have to stop at the services on the way because there's no way I can drive for two hours 40 minutes it's straight but yeah i'm excited i don't know how much i'm actually going to be able to film i feel like i need to get into the swing of like doing a long journey and then i can pop the camera on but yeah i hope you guys enjoy if you do please smash a huge thumbs up and other than that let's get started i am on my way i'm not gonna lie i'm having an absolute nightmare with this journey so my sat nav basically doesn't talk to me so i have to like just glance down at it and it's quite hard to read like, like i said this is the first long journey that i've done and um yeah i have missed the turning twice not once twice so i'm now like going up the motorway to have to go right back down the motorway i now get home at half past two and i was meant to get home at two o'clock so when i stop i'm literally gonna only have like 15 minutes to stop now but oh my god right where do i go this is so confusing i've never this is like i said this is the longest drive i'm doing on my own i'm quite proud of myself for even getting this far even though i do keep missing the exits but i will update you guys when i'm actually on the right way and i'm on the other side of the road update i'm finally on the way the only thing is with this sat nav is it doesn't tell me how how long i'm on this particular road for so i could be on here for like 50 miles or i could be on here for like two miles and it doesn't tell me which is the only really annoying thing but i now am on the right way i'm heading towards birmingham it says i'm going to get home at 25 past two really really annoying like added 20 minutes on but to be fair for my first drive i kind of expected you know i didn't think it was really going to go smooth i kind of knew that i would go a little bit wrong and we did just pass the service station as well and i was like oh do i go in do i not there was a burger king there was an m and s there was at Greg's, but I'm not gonna lie, I really would like a McDonald's. A McDonald's or a KFC, maybe. Or actually, I would really like a Burger King. I have I don't really get Burger King unless I'm like traveling. I feel like I only really get it when I'm traveling somewhere, but we're making good progress now, guys. We're on the way home. I'm gonna call my mum when I stop and let her know how the journey has been. But I've blasted my music. I wish I could put my music in, but you can't because of copyright. But blast my music. I can leave my car playlist down below. I made a new car playlist yesterday and it's just full of like throwback songs and I love it. Like tiny temper like proper proper like 2010 throwback and it's so good so i'll leave a link to my spot time playlist down below but other than that i am going to continue with the journey and fingers crossed there will be a service station soon because i would love to stop and get a drink i would love a wee and i would love some snacks i did bring some white chocolate fingers which i could snack on i'm not gonna lie but i do also want a burger so i will speak to you guys when we stop at the services i'm now at the services i think these are called like chorley services but it says that there's like an m&s there's a burger king and there's a kfc there's a starbucks so i have stopped I'm gonna wait here for like 15 20 minutes. I want to grab some food I feel like i've done really well on this journey now. I basically added an hour on not real well I was gonna say not really sure how it happened. I actually do know how it happened I went the wrong way, but i'm gonna go and get some food and I will show you guys what I get so I've got my food However, this is a very deceiving from burger king, right on the menu It said apple fries and it was a picture of fries So I thought well, that's weird like maybe 
they just called that. No, it's actually apple sticks. So instead of chips, I've got apple sticks, but it said fries and it was a picture of the fries. So I'm not really sure how that works or it's very deceiving, Burger like King. I think you need to put a picture of the apple sticks. I know it said apple fries, but when there's a picture of chips, you do automatically assume that it is chips. I did get a Coke though, got a little Pepsi and mum did call me um, and I let her know that I'm going to be there like just in time to pick Atticus up. So thank God. Also the most annoying thing ever. Oh, by the way, I got a Whopper. Love the Whoppers of cheese. So I was waiting for a parcel from PLT with some more dresses in to take to Dubai and it said it was going to be delivered just before I left. It didn't and as I got on the um, motorway, I got a text and my car was like, Royal Mail has delivered your parcel. And I was like, oh my God. So all my dresses are back in Manchester. So um, yeah, I don't have as many outfits as I thought I was going to for Dubai. Taste test. That was good. I really, really needed that. I was so excited to see Atticus's reaction to the car and my mum's and my nan's and Pam's and Chris's. I can't wait. This is such an exciting day for me. Right, I'm going to eat this. I'm going to get back on the road. The sun is blaring in, but I am now home. Mum is actually just outside the car. We're just waiting for Atticus to come out of school. That was actually a really nice drive. I'm not going to lie. Apart from the 30 minutes where I went completely, completely wrong and I don't really know what happened. That was a lovely drive. And every time I drive home now, I definitely won't dread that drive. Like it was nice. It was one road. It was long, but it was nice. I'm just so excited to see Atticus's reaction. Mum absolutely loves the car, which is really, really good. And she was saying that Atticus has no idea that I'm here. Literally no idea. Apparently he said to mum the other day, he was like, oh, I think Anna's coming home. And mum was like, no, like she's not coming home. Like she's not coming home until March now. And then apparently he just forgot about it and he like hasn't spoken about it since. So he definitely had a little idea, but then mum kind of shut it down. So he is clueless. Um, so I cannot wait to pick him up. I can't feel his actual reaction in the playground, but I can film his reaction to the car. So that'll be the next clip but yeah i'm actually gonna go film a another video with atticus today because you guys love seeing him on the channel and i want to film another video with him whilst i'm home and then oh, i'm gonna film going to get my nan as well which is so exciting i cannot wait to see my nan i can go over to my nan's at six so this has been a very successful drive with me apart from the fact that i went wrong i'm loving driving this car i'm actually loving life so i want to get back in now <laughs> Just like a little floating head. I love it. I have now got Atticus. He's in the front because we have just filmed a mukbang. Are you finished with this? No, still want it. Still eating. All right then, bubs. We've just filmed a little mukbang moment. Atticus loves the car. Like, mm. loves the car. Still Mini's my favourite car though. Still over this? Really? Yeah. This is my... Sixth favourite. So my, Mini's my favourite. What is it like a supercar that could be classed as? Lamborghini supercar. Obviously McLaren, Aston Martin, Corvette. I'm winding you up. What was that other thing called? Cadillac. I like Jaguars as well. You like Jaguars? Jaguars. <laughs> oh my, come out like that. <laughs> you called it Shag you You called it Daguars, didn't you? No, I didn't. You did. You called it Daguars. No, I didn't. We are going to go You to called it Daguars. By accident. We're going to go to Tesco. So what do you think of the car then? Rate it out of 10. Joking 10. I was going to say, it's better be a 10. Ask us his face when I walked into the playground was an absolute picture. He was like... You're loving it. It's roomy, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. You're going to put the rubbish in the bin for me? You need to come with me. Obvs. And then we're going to go to Tesco? Yeah. And I need to get a birthday card. For little Miss Tanisha. Little Miss Tanisha. So I'm going to Dubai with tonight and then what else? Are you a good sinner, Anna? No, you know I'm not. I can sing, but I'm not good. Are you? You are a good sinner. I wouldn't say I am. Oh, they should play this video someone made of you singing. Oh, I've seen it. Compilation, is that what it's called Have on you YouTube? In the bar? You on the bar? Yeah, I've seen it. I've seen it. Alia will always have you. Well, we'll always love you. <laughs> I, I will always love you. That was so good. Um, you sing low and I'll sing high. Are you ready? Yeah. I, I will always love you. Mummy's a terrible singer. Perhaps you harmonise with me though. No, you go high and I'll go low. Oh. And I, I will always love you. Let me tell you how bad mummy singing is. Oh no, mummy loves singing. I love singing, but I'm awful at it. Let me tell you what mummy does. Do you rate her singing? I could normally give it probably three. I'm good. Yeah, that's not good, is it? Should we drive to Tesco then? Yes. Yeah, I'm going to finish them at home. I can't have... Okay, we'll put this you in the one. bin. No, I'm alright. Thanks, Bubs. We need to put you in the back. Oh, no. uh, da, 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 da. How I meant to? Sweep the crumbs off outside the car. <laughs> how did you do that? Magic. Tell me how. Once you swept the crumbs off outside, I'll show you. Don't lock me out. I won't. I'm watching. I won't. There is so much stuff in this car. I need a clean out. Good 
boy, pop your seatbelt on. Right, like we're going to Tesco. We just got our Tesco and I got Pam some flowers, I got Mummy some flowers, and I got Nanny some flowers. And then and we also got Tanisha some mini eggs. Some mini eggs because I wanted to get her some flowers, but then we're going to Dubai, so I was like, she's not going to be able to do anything with the flowers. Um, So I just got her some chocolate. And we got and then Mummy some Ferrero. Ferrero Rocher eggs. And then I picked up a intensive purple mask because my hair's got a bit brassy. So I'm going to use this. Mummy keeps before. saying you're not allowed to use Mommy it. Mummy says I shouldn't, but I'm going to use it anyway. I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to use it before we go. So I will speak to you guys when we are on our way to Nan's. So lovely to see you. Oh, I missed you, Nanny. Oh, my darling. Oh, oh yeah. I'm good. How are you? Oh, it's so lovely to see you. Oh, I missed you. Oh, bless you, heart. I love you with all my heart. I love you too, Nanny. Mwah. I ain't letting you go yet. <laughs> I'm not gonna let you go yet, am I? No, not yet. Oh, bless you, right? It's so Aww. lovely to see you. Oh, darling! Oh, you are getting big, have ya? We got you some flowers, Nanny. Oh, bless you, right? <laughs> Aren't they lovely? Oh, bless you! Where did you go? Tesco. Tesco. We didn't. We did. Oh, wow. So, what have you both been up to? Well, that's no, that. you are. That's gentleman. What Anastasia likes eating chips. What's what? Anastasia likes chips. I know Senorita. Anastasia. French fries, I French say. fries is tripulators. I don't know what likes is there. You're good, isn't it, Nanny? Mm -hmm. You're good. What have you Definitely. learned, Atticus? Fatter. What's that? Means bad day. Bad day? Fatter. Fatter means a bad day? Yeah. What else have you learned? Let me think. Hola. Adios. Hello and goodbye. Oh, Anna, what? I got some vans the other day. Some vans? Yeah, shoes. Guess what her baby name was? Who's? Atticus. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. It's lovely. Are you enjoying it, Annie? Really, Can you I'm open darling. my sweet corn so it cools down, Anna? Yeah. I'm not open it so it cools down. It's really nice. Do some it. chickens not. Like me. Isn't it? This is probably one of the nicest KFCs I've ever had. Yeah, it's lovely. This is. Have you got many food places near you? Oh, Nanny, I've got loads. Wait, where? Where? In Dubai or in Manchester? In Manchester. Yeah, I've got loads. What about here? We have quite a few here. Yeah, you've got loads here as well. Nanny, have you ever heard of Tim Hortons? It's no. a new one they've opened. Yeah. What is that? Is it a food place? It originally came from Canada. Canada, mm -hmm. yeah. And yeah, but they've brought it into the UK. There's one at... I've got one in Manchester. There's one at Riverside. What do they do, Africa? Like, they do donuts? They do cheese toasties yeah cheese toasties chicken oh, yeah. instead of chips they do an all-day breakfast what is it instead of chips potato fry waffle things yeah. they don't do scrambled egg or anything they do pancakes